Welcome to this multimedia training course in software testing. This course has been designed to provide you with a broad overview of the knowledge and skills required to carry out software testing at a professional level. A more specific intention of this course is to provide you with sufficient knowledge to sit and pass the ISEB Foundation Certificate in Software Testing. Those who will benefit from this course include people operating or intending to operate in an application development or software testing environment, including testers, test analysts, test engineers, test consultants, test managers, user acceptance testers, and software developers, individuals and organizations requiring an understanding of the basic concepts of software testing. Individuals wishing to gain formal qualifications in software testing in particular, those people who prefer to study at their own pace. In this introductory module, we will describe the structure of the e-learning course and highlight some of the useful features, outline the foundation level qualification and look at the examining bodies associated with it, review the history of the qualification thus far, describe the syllabus on which this course is based and clarify the structure of the learning objectives. Briefly review the makeup of the foundation examination itself. Before we begin, let's take a few moments to introduce you to the makeup of the course. The course is divided into seven modules, each subdivided into a number of sections. Each module focuses on a particular area of study. Specifically, these are Module 1, The Introduction. Module 2, The Fundamentals of Testing. Module 3, Testing Through the Life Cycle. Module 4, Static Techniques. Module 5, Test Design Techniques. Module 6, Test Management. And finally, Module 7, Tool Support for Testing. Throughout the modules and associated subsections, you'll find interactive tests and questions intended to test your knowledge and to help your learning. Whether you answer correctly or not, all activities provide useful feedback. Also included in the course is a fully functional exam simulator. This exam simulator is intended to provide you with plenty of practice of answering questions similar to those you will encounter in the exam proper. You may well have noticed some other features included in the course's interface. These include a very useful interactive glossary of terms, as well as a list of useful acronyms. The resources provide access to the examination syllabus along with a comprehensive bibliography. The foundation level qualification is aimed at anyone involved in software testing. This includes people in roles such as testers, test analysts, test engineers, test consultants, test managers, user acceptance testers, and software developers. The foundation level qualification is also appropriate for anyone who wants a basic understanding of software testing, such as project managers, quality managers, software development managers, business analysts, IT directors, and management consultants. Holders of the Foundation Certificate will be able to go on to a higher level software testing qualification. The independent certification of software testers began in the UK with the British Computer Society's Information Systems Examination Board, or ISEB, when a software testing board was set up in 1998. In 2002, German-based ASQF began to support a German tester qualification scheme. This syllabus is based on the ISEB and ASQF syllabi. It includes reorganized, updated, and some new content. The emphasis is directed at topics that will provide the most practical help to testers. An existing foundation certificate in software testing, for example, those from ISEB, ASQF, or an ISTQB recognized national board awarded before this international certificate was released will be deemed to be equivalent to the international certificate. The foundation certificate does not expire and does not need to be renewed. The date it was awarded is shown on the certificate. Within each participating country, local aspects are controlled by a national ISTQB recognized software testing board. 
Duties of national boards are specified by the ISTQB, but are implemented within each country. The duties of the country boards are expected to include accreditation of training providers and the setting of exams. These objectives were adapted from an early ISTQB meeting in Sweden in November 2001 to be able to compare testing skills across different countries, to enable testers to move across country borders more easily, to enable multinational and international projects to have a common understanding of testing issues, to increase the number of qualified testers worldwide, to have more impact or value as an internationally based initiative than from any country specific approach to develop a common international body of understanding and knowledge about testing through the syllabus and terminology and to increase the level of knowledge about testing for all participants to promote testing as a profession in more countries to enable testers to gain a recognized qualification in their native language to enable sharing of knowledge and resources across countries and finally to provide international recognition of testers and this qualification due to participation from many countries.